I do apologize. Am I disturbing you? No, please. Do come in, Mrs... My name is Miss Alice de Bouvier. I'm Mr. Holmes' new neighbor. Oh, I didn't have the pleasure to... Uh, I am Dr. John Watson. Could we provide you with any assistance? Uh, she is not the concern, Watson. I'm... <laughs> then, what is this about? Uh, that child standing sniffling behind her. Get rid of him, Watson. But he is shivering with cold. And he is upset. What happened to him? Little Tom knocked at the wrong door. Oh, for crying out loud. Oh, boy, come in. Warm yourself by the fire. Can I offer you a cup of tea, Mr. Bouvier? Well, I... It is not as though we are disturbing you-know-who. Are we? I suppose not. Since you are our new neighbor, it is perhaps better that you know what he's like. You're starting to worry me. Well, Mr. Holmes is relapsing. This illness that he has seizes him when he finds himself with nothing to do. He becomes completely asocial. And alas, this is a very difficult, medically incurable case. Now this must stay between us. Of course, I understand. How very sad. But there is a cure, if only a temporary one. A thrilling inquiry. Most certainly. If he refuses this one, then his condition will worsen. Oh, I am still here, you know. I didn't fall out of the window. Very well, then. Thank you, miss. Now tell me, boy, what brings you here? It's... it's my father, sir. He's missing. I... I don't know what to do. What's his name? George Hurst, sir. Missing, eh? And what do the police say? The police? They don't believe me. What do you mean, sir? Nothing. I was digressing. And when was the last time you saw him? Three weeks ago. He left for a new job. But this time, he was acting a bit strange and angry. 
strange. In what way? He said to me, Son, I'm out on a special job. Don't you dare move from here. I think something went wrong. Three weeks? That's a long time. Well, every day I thought he would show up. And anyway, I can look after myself. Very well. Your address, please, Tom. 12 Dorset Street. The first floor, door E. It's in Whitechapel, sir. But I ain't got no money to pay. Who asked for money, Tom? Your case seems to be the very medicine I need. I'll meet you there shortly. Oh, thank you, sir. My, ar my archive. I can always consult with it if needed. A map of London and its surroundings. Could be useful. We need to help Tom find his father, Holmes. My analysis table. It's useful for my work. My archive. I can always consult with it. These streets are too narrow for the cab, I'll have to walk. North Street. North Street. Dorset Street. I don't feel thirsty right now. Dorset Street.
Who's at home, Mr. Holmes? Probably taken from a wall. The old Tabard pub, North Street. Please, sir, find my father. Tom probably reads at night. Huh. So that's why you came to see me. Huh. 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 So that's why you came to see me. Tom probably reads at night. A collection of worn out and second hand books. Father bought all those books for me. He... Food's running low. It's already three weeks since George Hurst's disappearance. Well, I can see the preparations for peasant soup, a clever concoction for somebody with apparently no culinary skills. My mother, sir, she died when I was very young. My father told me what she was like, but that's all I have. I'm sorry, Tom. My mother left me when I was very young, too. Hurst covered his bills ahead of time, thus providing Tom with security and sustenance. George Hurst's work was varied. He was evidently a hard-working and valuable hand. The roof leaks all the time. Father used to fix it. Old clothes, soiled and worn. It's too dark. I can't see anything. Just some old things. A leather satchel, what's in it?
The old Tabard pub? Did you hear anything about it from your father, Tom? My father's a regular, but he's not a drinker, sir. It's close by on North Street. 